To get air in, the ventilator has to fight three battles, the tube, the airways, and the lungs. During mechanical ventilation, the ventilator delivers air through the endotracheal tube, down the airways, and into the alveoli. To do this, it must overcome two main types of resistance, the airway resistance from the ET tube and conducting airways, and the elastic resistance from the alveoli and the lung tissues. The resistance in the ET tube and airways is primarily due to their narrow lumens and flow dynamics. The pressure required to overcome this kind of resistance is called resistive pressure and it's calculated by multiplying the flow rate by the airway resistance. So resistive pressure equals flow times resistance. In contrast, the alveoli are evaluated based on their compliance, their ability to stretch and accommodate volume. The pressure required to overcome alveoli and lung tissue stiffness is called elastic pressure and it's calculated by dividing volume by compliance. So elastic pressure equals volume divided by compliance and in mechanical ventilation the volume here simply represent the tidal volume and the elastic pressure represent the alveolar pressure